Good morning. It's Lisa with Soul Shine, and it's morning tea with me. And today I have, oh, I should have remembered. Not Snickerdoodle, not Raining Cherries. It's the third one I bought. Ah, oh, I've lost track of what I did. It smells really good, though. I think it's got almond flavoring in it. I should have looked at which one I put in, sorry. But it is delicious, and it's a perfect weather for tea because it is chilly outside, so I hope you guys are staying put. And uh, all the schools are canceled, apparently. So, um, yeah, it's a good stay-in kind of hangout day and drink tea. Um, this morning, when I was in my quiet time, I listened to a meditation series by Louise Hay, and she is like, she's got the most peaceful voice and positive affirmations, and she's just the bomb. And today she said something that really clung to me a little bit. It, she said, um, at the start of her meditation, she said, um, get really comfortable and notice if there's any um, Klingons or um, carryovers from your dreams or your sleep. Maybe your your neck kinks a little bit, or maybe you're a little bit anxious over a dream that you had. And she said just to notice it and breathe into it and let it go. And I thought that translates so perfectly into life, but so often I don't do it. Instead of um, just noticing it, like a um, I don't know, a careless out, uh, outstander or um, bystander that would just kind of notice um, something happening from afar and not feel the need to address it or fix it or resolve it or even speak to it or acknowledge it. Um, just to notice it and breathe and let it go. <laughs> and with the upcoming holidays and family and change in routine, I tend to get anxious right here this little block feels like compressed and anxious and that's where I kind of carry my anxiety and it tickles a little blurb in the, my middle back it just like hives like tickles like mm. so when I notice that I need to train myself and discipline to just notice it and breathe into it and let it go <laughs> and not feel like I need to fix every single thing so hopefully that relays over into your world with the upcoming holidays and changing of schedules and seasons and activities and all that stuff that could very easily cause some of this <laughs> anxiety. I hope that you know that I'm sending you much love and I hope that you have a most marvelous day. Love you much. Mwah, mwah, mwah.